Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We're gonna be bumping a lot of stuff today. Anyways guys, today we're gonna be looking at the Rainbow High Color Change Pool and Beach Club. It's more of just a pool and a patio rather than, you know, a beach club, but you know, go off. But guys, I bought this off of Amazon. It was $59.99, it's around like 65, maybe after taxes. We did the free shipping because who pays for shipping when you have a free option, right? I've been very eager for this. This is what I've been most excited about for this whole like Pacific Coast collection, the Stam Pool. I don't know why. But I'm like such a big playset fan and like I because I didn't have a lot of playsets as a kid that I'm just so ecstatic about this this little pool But also I'm very excited to display the entire collection once I get it all into this pool And I'm actually hoping that it fits into my shelves. We're gonna see if it does But yeah guys, let me just roll the intro and we shall start looking at the box and everything that this comes with So three two one Hello? Hit Ariana Grande note. Okay, guys. So this box is really big. Probably like seven pounds. I'm not sure. <laughs> it started popping up at Walmart in stores, and I think some targets are actually getting it. I don't know. It's supposed to be out though right now. Do with that information as you may. MJ was actually going to send me this, but like I got a little bit impatient and I bought it. So MJ, if you're still sending me it, um, I will probably use it for a giveaway. But anyways, guys, we have a picture of Bella, Finn, Simone, and Phaedra at the pool enjoying it. It's actually a really cute picture. I think this is like I think the artwork they did for this collection has been so cute and I really love it. But basically we have the Rainbow High logo up here and it says color change pool and beach club. We have this really pretty sunset background with the ocean. We have some palm trees. We have the characters and we have the pool set. It also says you can choose your pool color. It could go from red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. I'm excited to see how bright that's going to be in person because I'm not sure how it is. You know, I'm going to turn the studio lights off and it says YouTube right over there. Ooh, look at my hairy arm. We turn it to the side. The beaches are playground at Pacific Coast. The most elite fine arts high school on the west coast we have some pictures of bella and harper in the pool and they're, they're just you know looking super cute i'm excited to take photos in this and i am going to fill it with water so excited here is another picture of bella and harper and here they are enjoying the beach um i don't know why it's just bella and harper but you know maybe they are hogging the pool i don't know and it says it fits rainbow high fashion doll so i'm like like no duh but oh, okay if you flip it around it's the same picture from the front and if we go on this side it shows you everything that is included this is technically rainbow high it's like first ever sold alone playset. You know, they did have the dollhouse come out last year, but I mean, this is like a playset playset. And I don't really count the fashion closet as a playset or the salon chair. They're just kind of accessory pieces. And this is like an actual playing piece. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, guys, enough of me rambling. Let's get opening this box and see what everything is about inside the color change pool. So let me get my scissor. Okay, guys, so in that box was just, you know, a bigger box. We love that. But anyways, let me get everything out and we shall start looking at it. Okay guys, so it's fully assembled now and um, I did take a few weeks to do this. <laughs> it's finally here. We can now finally look into it and review it. I don't know where to start with this guy. 
But basically this play set is pretty big according to my measure. This pool is about two feet and just about a foot in dimension because of this um, palm tree little stem holder, I guess you could say. I was trying to put it on my actual physical bookshelf, but because of the palm tree little holder in the back over there, that's kind of a circle. It makes it protrude out a little and it doesn't look great on a shelf. So I'm probably going to be putting it on the top of my bookshelf so that it actually fits. But guys, with that out of the way, get into this play set, shall we? So everything you see on the screen is what you get with this play set. You get two little lounge chairs, you get a table, you get an umbrella, you get two palm trees that are removable. You get the pool that does come in and out. You get two of these little drinks and two of these bar chairs. We'll look into all these in depth in a second. But yeah, guys, this pool is actually quite big and it does actually hold all of the Pacific Coast dolls in it pretty nicely. You don't really need their stands either. And you are gonna need three AA batteries to make the light feature work. I kind of broke my whole nail off when I was originally building this because the primary button, which is in the back, was like super stuck and I kind of just went and then my nail bed went back. Um, it's fully grown out now, but just be careful with that. If yours is not working either, don't try to manually do it with your fingernails. Try to use like a tool or something. I use the flathead to actually do it though. But yeah, guys, anyways, let's get into the playset and what everything comes with and what it's like. Okay, so we're gonna start with the little deck area. You get this cute little section that is separate. So if you did want to just display the deck or just the pool itself, you can separate it. It's up to you and your display space, of course. It has a nice fake wood look to it. As you can see, all the individual little grooves are painted with this darker brown color and I did not know it was going to do that. That's a really cool detail that they did right there. And as you can see, there is a little step right here so your dolls can like walk up to the deck. And you do get two of these little lounge chairs. They are made of that same material that some of the Rainbow High house furniture is made of that's supposed to feel like it's soft but it's just a very viable plastic. As you can see, I'm bending on it. It's really nice. It does not recline or anything. The frame is gold and it has a white seating area with a faux pillow. Armrests are white as well. The white is actually kind of pearlescent. It's kind of showing on the camera slightly but it's super nice and you get this cute little side table it has that kind of marbling effect on it and it has two little sections for the cups to go into it like so it does not keep them in they kind of fall out it's a cute little table though the bottom is gold now as for this umbrella it does go back and forth i'm going to actually take it off the pedestal as you guys saw in the building process there is a little peg right here and that just snaps into that little peg so if you do not want to display the umbrella on the deck you're going to have that little peg there and it is kind of annoying but Oh well. The umbrella is actually made of a fabric material. It is very much serving what Margaret has all over her. It's the same material as her little head wrap. It says rainbow in this very shifty metallic holographic kind of print and it is white and silver by the way. The top has a little gold dot. If you look inside of the umbrella you can see all the umbrella legs and it does actually open and close. So all you got to do is pull it this way like so and then when you want to reopen your umbrella all you got to do is pop it open. It's really cute. Moving on to the palm trees, you get a tall one and you get a somewhat shorter one. Palm trees are actually really well detailed. As you can see, the trunk of the palm tree is painted really nicely and it is very shiny. These guys just peg in at the base like so. The tops of them are made of two sets of leaves. They're painted in a green to a lighter yellowish green ombre effect to look like real palm trees. I really do like the palm trees. I think they're going to be really cool for photography outside of the pool, but they are quite annoying for, you know, the display purposes and their base and all that stuff. Now that we've looked at the deck, it is time to look at the pool area. You get a really big blue transparent pool. As I mentioned, it does slide in and out so you can fill it with water easy and also dump the water out after you're done playing with it. And it just slides right into this little groove for it. Behind the pool, you can see there's some steps leading up to, you know, I guess get into the pool, but then you would kind of be on the bar kind of, sort of. So I don't know how that works, but whatever. And it's also made of that marbling material as well. You could kind of see it in this lighting. As for the little railing. It is made of a gold plastic and it's really sturdy. Right here you can see there's a button. We'll tap that after but mine has like some kind of like residue or something on it and it's kind of nasty. As we get to this side you can see we have the bar. Marbling is continuing on this little bar as well. There's also six spots for these drinks to click in. They just kind of chill there. They don't really snap in but it's a really good idea that they did that. And for some reason there's this R8. It looks like it was supposed to be a button but it's not a button but um interesting. <laughs> if we look at the bar stool they are made of that same gold plastic as the railing and some of the other pieces in the set. They have high legs and their white plastic is not soft like the lounge chairs. It's a hard solid plastic. Now that is everything that comes with this pool. I do kind of wish that it came with some towels and some other accessories like food or maybe a floaty or a balloon. Something like that that the dolls can play with inside of the pool. Other than that, I think it's a really cool play set. But let me fill it up with some dolls and show you how they work. And then we shall also fill up the pool with some water and turn the lights off and see how the lights work. 
works. So BRB. Okay guys, so I filled the pool and deck with five dolls. I would have put Margo in this too, but her hair is currently setting for tomorrow's video. So yeah. But guys, as you can see, it comfortably fits five dolls. You probably can put at least a tops of four more dolls to this place that if you really, really wanted to, you can have another doll in the pool. You can also have another doll on one of these chairs right here. A doll could be sitting there if you wanted to. And even if you really, really wanted to shove another doll in here to make it five more, you could put one right behind Simone holding the umbrella and you would have a pretty full looking set. You know what I'm saying? Now, the only thing left that we need to do with this review is test out the pool and the lighting. So I have my water ready and I'm going to fill up this pool. I don't know why I'm excited, but I know I'm going to make a big mess. So period. <laughs> Okay guys, so I filled up the pool. It is also a very, very messy. So if you're going to be doing this, um, make sure you have towels and make sure you protect your play area or etc. you know, just so you don't spill water everywhere, you know. But guys, now we are going to test out the water features. I already flipped the switch on in the back and now all I need to do is dim my lights and I can show you the light features. So before I go completely dark in the room, I want to show you that button. You could click through each color in the rainbow, so red through purple, or you could click through a fade show. So it will go through all the colors in the rainbow. It's very similar to the car. So trigger warning guys, just in case you have epilepsy shock or anything, please don't look at this video just in case. I don't want nothing happening to you guys. But anyways, let me start doing the lights, shall I? So there is the red, here is orange, here is the yellow, here is green, the superior color blue, here is purple, and here is it fading from all the colors in the rainbow. It looks so cool in the dark. It's like really a bougie pool and I really do love how it looks. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. It's actually really bright even with my little light on. Honestly, perfect. I think each light show lasts either 30 seconds to a minute. You don't get the lights that long. It's cute enough for a photo shoot if you needed to or for play. It's like you see, it just turned off right now. And let me show you what it looks like with all my studio lights on just to show. You can barely see that it's glowing because my lights are just so bright. But yeah. But yeah, guys, that is the Rainbow High Pacific Coast Pool and Beach Club playset. It is actually a really cool playset, I gotta be honest. I think it's so cute. I'm a playset stan, and I've always loved playsets since I was a little kid. And I just love playsets. They're so cool. And this one is super cool. I feel like if you want a Rainbow High playset, I would totally recommend getting this guy. It is $60 now. Um, Just in case that is a little too high for your price point, I would totally maybe recommend waiting on a sale. But if you're like me and you could and wait to get it just buy it it's totally worth it i think it is super cute i do wish that it came with a little more pieces like food and some towels and some etc pieces it does come with a good amount of furniture it just needs more little accessories and it would be mwah. But yeah guys let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on the rainbow high pool are you gonna get it do you already have it i'm very late to this review i've had this for a while i've just got very lazy i just didn't want to do it <laughs> honestly i love it i think it's super cute and if you're new to the channel hi my name is jay and i do doll stuff duh and I would love you to join the fam. And if you are following me on Instagram or on TikTok, it is also at ZombieXCorn. And I do have a PO box. It is in the description with all these other links you may need. But guys, until next time, bye.